We are created by God to rest. You ever wondered why? You ever thought, gee, sleep is stupid. Anyone ever thought, why, why can't I just keep going? But we have to rest. We have to sleep. It says in the, in the opening chapters of Genesis about God, Genesis chapter 2 and verse 2, And on the seventh day, God finished his work that he had done, and he rested on the seventh day from all his work he had done. So God blessed the seventh day and made it holy. Note this, because on it, God rested from all his work that he had done in creation. So note this, how does the unto- how does, why does the untiring God, whom the psalmist says he never tires, slumbers or sleeps... Why did the untiring God need to rest? Because it tells us something about rest. It tells us that rest is not just having a schnooze. It's also about taking a break. It's also about resting from regular activity or routine activity. So rest can simply be a change of scenery, walk away from your whatever you're doing and take, take a break, because God did. So rest is also ceasing from regular activity. That's why some people take a rest by going for a jog. You nutters. Some people take a rest by going for a long walk. Some people, like my wife, take a rest by doing both at the same time, and trying to drag their husband along willingly on an 80 kilometre bushwalk. Unwillingly, sorry, I meant, anyway. So here's the, here's the thing, and I say that because we can look at some, some people and we think, if you're that tired, why are you going off and physically exerting? Because their tiredness didn't derive from physical exertion. Their tiredness may have derived from hanging out with people with problems. Now they need to get away. And it can be physically draining. But they get away and their rest is actually something that for most, most of us we would find physically draining. But for them it's a change of activity. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like. If you'd like to see more, hit the subscribe button. For more information about our church, head over to lagana.org.